All right, so so I'm here on the on the eve of our Halloween game for Mod Night, and a couple things to show you guys. First of all, this is Mark II of the lens adapter. Now, this may look kind of silly and pointless, although this is essentially just shotgun mode. What we have are a bunch of modular lens arrangements, um, and then a uh, boom, instant sniper rifle, just like that. And there's different lenses you'll see that we are testing tonight. You shall see the fruits of that testing, because the fruit is delicious. Anyway, um, this thing's all set up. This is Mark II of that. So these pretty much are set to go. We're going to start not so much mass producing these, but just start making more of these. So that way, modifications to the LTAR, as far as lens, lens arrangements, additions go, will be a lot easier. And uh, switching over to our candidates for testing. Change. There we are. Um, first up... This is essentially a standard Phoenix LTX. There's nothing really fancy about it other than this awesome um, stock on the back here and the red dot that helps you with accuracy. But it's still got the stock range and firing power of a Phoenix LTX. So we'll show you how, how that compares just kind of as a control case. And then we have three, actually four different lenses that we'll be showing you. Um, this one is very similar to uh, what is in the LTX EF5. Oh, where's my... There we are. Um, it's longer, and uh, you'll see what the focus is like when we do the tests there. And then these two, as well as the one on that guy, these are... Uh, is it stubby or stumpy? Which, which is it? It's, it's stubby. Okay, good. Um, stubby Mark One on that one. Nice. Mark Two on this one and then Mark III with the blue to help differentiate because they're pretty much the same size. There's slight variations in them. And essentially what we'll be doing is we'll be using this awesome LTX or Ultimate LTX, or whatever we decide to call it. This has got all kinds of fun stuff on it. The Shot Blast mod has been relocated up here. It's got the long range lens, so close or far he can still get you. It's got a red dot sight up here and then a aluminum fitted folding airsoft stock that's metal on the back there just for stability when he is kicking your ass so um yeah let's uh let's we're gonna move things over to the night vision camera all right we're starting things off with a essentially a standard uh phoenix ltx laser tag blaster um, i'm gonna do two tests with this one with the shot blast on one with it off it does affect the the the, the focus of it a little bit so we'll come back here and shooting. Okay, and then I guess I'll do a shot blast. Oops, I'm hitting my friends. Just a big wide flash. And then with the shot blast off, hardly any difference. If nothing else, just a little bit clearer with it off because it's not passing through that, that fake lens up there. All right, so um, that's how a standard blaster would work. Turn that guy off for now. Next up is a standard uh, LTAR. Um, you'll notice that flashing there. That's the uh, infrared beacon going out there for friendly fire and lock-on signals and all that fun stuff. So hopefully I won't screw up too much stuff. All right. About the same. It's almost a little bit clearer. You can see there is kind of a big inner ring and a small outer ring, or more like just like a bit of a gap that goes around it. Anyway, that's, that's that fella. Turn him off. And now we're going to be switching lenses around. We're going to start off, let's see, this is uh, the Ultimate LTX. This has got that awesome shot blast up here in the stock. The lenses we're going to be switching out. This lens, this white one, is very close to what was in the original Nerf Recon Mark III or IV or whatever version it was on at the time. And also the, uh, the LTX EF5. Here we go. Nice, tight focus, but uh, it's a little fuzzy around the edges. No halo. Actually, that's really funny. Look, you can actually see the inside of this lighting up when it fires. Did you guys notice that? 
That's really awesome. All right. Enough of that guy. Um, next up is Stubby. Um, this one is considerably shorter in length. Same diameter as the one that we had on there before. Even better focus. And you'll notice that there is a little bit of a sweet spot in the middle of that as well. Now there are two others of these little monsters that we have in our arsenal. This is Mark II that was sent to us. It's unpainted currently because it's not on a blaster yet. There, the, look guys, it's, it's lighting up. That's awesome. Almost the same focus. Maybe a little more, maybe a little more fuzz around the edge on this one, which isn't all bad. And then uh, last guy, um, we put a blue ribbon on this to differentiate him from his cousin. Mark three, about the same. So um, those are the different types of lenses that we're running around with with, uh, with our laser tag group. Stuff that's going on, customized blasters and all that super fun, awesome stuff. Cool, how do I turn it? <laughs>